test, test. Testing, testing. Okay, now it can hear me for some reason. All right. Okay. I think that's solved now. See if I can turn the volume down on the game a little bit. No? Okay. Alright. Welcome back. Sorry for the delay. Had a little bit of audio issues. But we should be good to go now. Okay, so last time we were here, our group of uh, theater nerds uh, went to kidnap a princess who wanted to be kidnapped. They crashed in a fort in an evil forest, got petrified, uh, escaped, and are now on the run. The princess has also renamed herself Knife. This is a real knife. I wonder. I wonder if the castle is okay. That was quite a ruckus. Mother went too far. She didn't have to fire at the ship, even if it, even if she did it to rescue me. I don't think firing at a ship is a good so is a good sign of someone trying to rescue you, but whatever. I wonder how many people got hurt. I hope the damage wasn't too severe. Some people could have died, like in the evil forest. You're in my way, kiddo. Kiddo? Oh, my apologies. I mean, I'm sorry. Kids these days. What are you doing? Can't you see what I'm doing? I'm killing the bugs on the crops. You're killing the bugs? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Bugs are just like monsters. They destroy your crops if you leave them be. Crops? How do you, how do you not know what a crop is? There's one. Oh, an ooglop. Ooglops eat vegetables? You're a strange one. Most girls hate ooglops. Is that so? It's just that I haven't seen too many of them. Wait, Zidane told me to try and blend in. Maybe I should act like I don't like ooglops. One, two, three. Ah! <sighs> All right. It's a loud ass cat. Oh, it's you. What should I do? I don't want to give in to my brother, but everyone else is making money except me. Hey, wasn't that customer traveling with? I won't have to give in if, if I tell him about them. Alright, 
Is there anything I need to buy? Let's see here. I don't know if the feather hat has anything. Oh, it does. Bright eyes add status. Bright eyes is good to have. Adds weapon status effect. Add stat when you attack. Might as well have it. Bright eyes prevents darkness. I think I can see inside. I missed a treasure chest. No one's back yet. Damn it. I must speak with this girl and learn how common folk speak. Welcome. Um, yes, can we talk for a bit? Talk? What should I say? Um, Eve! Gotcha! Can't you see I'm with a customer? But I just heard something awesome! Awesome? Can't you see I'm working? Um, please, I mean, I don't mind. Here's a chance to listen in on some conversation. Thanks, lady. I was going to say. Potion. Nailed it. Knife. What's she looking at? <laughs> Zidane? You got a fever or something? Your face is all red. It, it's nothing. I'm fine. You're acting strange. What? I get it. You changed the way you talk. You're doing great. Thanks. I did fine in the plane, didn't I? Oh yeah, I thought you were Ruby. I'm a big fan of Lord Avon's plays. I mean, I have, I mean, I've seen all of them. I Want to Be Your Canary is one of my favorites. Oh yeah? Is Ruby the young lady with a strange accent? Uh, yeah. Should I talk more like her? What? No, no. She's really finicky about her speech. She's always She always laughs at us whenever we try to mimic her. So you should just be yourself, Knife. I understand. Alrighty. <laughs> we, need to, we need to decide what to do from here. Will you go back to the inn? What about you? I'm going to go look for Vivian Steiner. Alrighty, I'll catch you later. Good, you sound just like a regular village girl. Crossing the border might not be so tough after all. Thanks, I had fun. She was a strange one. Just having a look -sees. Hey, Vivi, what's up? Zidane. N nothing I was just thinking. Ah, I see. You met a girl. No, no, nothing like that. What? Don't tell me you like... Don't tell me you don't like girls. 
I never really thought about stuff like that. I'm always thinking about girls. I'm popular with all the ladies in Lindblom. Come to me if you have any girl trouble, okay? Sure, thanks. Okay then, we need to decide what to do. I asked Knife to head back to the inn. Would you mind going back there too? Sure, I'll head back. So, what are you staring at? Nothing. But I keep hearing a sound like Kwe. That's the sound chocobos make. I'll see you back at the end. Okay. What are chocobos? Chocobo? Oh! Huh? I'll just let Steiner B go back to the end. <laughs> oh, the look on his face. He sent someone to pick it up right away. All I need to do now is keep quiet until the guests leave. Gotta pretend I'm asleep. <laughs> Meow. Meow. Did you wait long? I asked Vivi to head back. You should be back soon. How do you like this village? Pretty different from the castle, I bet. Yes, the kids are very energetic and there are so many things to see. I've never walked around so freely before in my life. But... Where are all the adults? Yeah. I used to see them tending the farm next to the village. But that farm is tiny. Yeah. There's something strange going on. We'll leave once Vivi gets back. But, what about Steiner? I have a good plan for cro crossing Southgate. It's gonna be easy. They're not looking for the rest of us, so we'll just hide you. Forget about Rusty. Leave everything to me. Firewood stacking duties are complete. I await your command. It's my job to clean the bar. Why are you doing all this? S sorry. Well, now that you have time, would you introduce me to some adults like your father? My father won't be back until nightfall. All the other men are also working. They don't come they don't come here during the day. Pubs are supposed to be a prime source of information. Ahem. I need not ask an adult. Let me ask you a question. I need to know about what transportation method people use in this village. I cannot tell you the reason, but there is someone I must escort to the castle. Are you from Alexandria Castle? Indeed. I command the Queen's Knights of Pluto. I am Adalbert Steiner, captain of the Knights of Pluto. Knights of Pluto? Oh. Well, if you're from the castle, I guess it's okay to tell you. Please go to the observatory on top of the mountain on the outskirts of the village. An old man named Morid lives there. He takes care of the cargo ship. Cargo ship? So that piece of junk flies to this village. Thank you. Wait. Yes? Thank you for cleaning. Nay, it is I who should thank you for assistance. I must take haste. Make haste. Whatever. As it turned out, it didn't matter that we snuck into their mansion. But the kings were hiding something in but the kings were hiding something in their mansion. What's wrong? Am I boring you? Oh no, your story is very interesting. But I'm concerned about Vivi. Why isn't he back yet? You're right, he is late. I'm not worried about Steiner, but Vivi I'm not so sure about. 
Let's go look for him. Uh, she can't get Bright Eyes or Mad Status. Oh well. Okay. Save real quick. Ah! Wait a minute. Last time I saw Vivi, he was standing over there. Did I hear a chocobo? Vivi said he heard a chocobo here. <laughs> Is someone crying? <laughs> it's coming from that hole. Vivi? Zidane? Vivi, where are you? Are you underground? Can you move? They told me to stay here. Are you hurt? No. Don't, don't worry. We'll get you out. We'll hurry, so stay where you are, okay? Okay. What's going on in this village? There's got to be a way into the underground somewhere. Let's look for one. Okay. Seems like such a quiet village. Can't get near the treasure box while the windmill is turning. Wish I could remember how to get over to those. How did you get stuck in that hole? Received Aries. Aries. Gonna need a key to open this up. It says Mayor's Key here. <laughs> Isn't this obvious? There's a cool breeze. Let's go down. A hundred fifty six gill. Woo. Don't spend it all in one place. This isn't. Just a regular underground storage facility. What's going on? Shh. Why is it moving? Is it true that the mayor's brother found it? I guess they reconciled. His brother's one of us now. Wasn't he on the old lady's side before? Oh, about ab abandoning the farm? He probably only said that because he was fighting with the mayor. Who cares? We need more workers anyways. Hey, let's put this in a, in a box. I guess the guys at the castle will take care of it. The castle? Yep, we're only in charge of production. Gotcha. The pattern on this barrel. Come along now. Hurry it up. Vivi! That bastard! Zidane, wait! Jeez, hey! How did y'all miss them? What is it? Did you see the large barrel next to the shed? I've seen the exact same pattern on some of the barrels of the castle. This place must have some kind of connection with Alexandria Castle. I must know what it is. So please, I beg of you, don't cause any trouble yet. Alright. 
but I will start trouble if Evie is in danger. Agreed? Sure. Alrighty, let's go. They went further inside. What do they use the sparrow for anyway? Is it some it is some kind of it is kind of weird now that I think about it. <coughs> Excuse me. Potion. Big chocobo. What is this Moogle doing? Can I help you, Koopa? I have a favor to ask, Koopa. Could you deliver this letter to Mogki? Okay. Thanks, Koopa. Let's save. so many sneezes yeah i've been i've been sneezing a lot lately freaking allergies have been killing me i don't know what's been going on out here all right now how do i get that one Kick it. Oh, there we go. Leather wrists. Do I need leather wrists for anything? Oh, I already have it. Iron Helmet for Steiner. Anything else in here? Nope. Okay. What the heck is that? Zidane! What is it? Someone's crying. That box is crying. Are you having a rough time, box? Vivi? Zidane? It is you. I'll get you out. Why would they stuff you in a box? How could they? Uh, um. We'll talk later. Hold on. It's open. What happened? After you left, some men kidnapped me and brought me here. They told me to stay put. I was so scared, I didn't know what to do. They asked me, why were you outside? And then they said, the cargo ship isn't even here yet. I didn't know what they were talking about, so I didn't say anything. And then they said, let's put it in today's shipment. And then they, and then they put you in, a, in that box? Yeah. Well, I'm glad you're safe. Listen, Vivi, you gotta do something next time. You should try screaming back or whatever. Screaming? Yeah, like... Get off me, you scumbag! Scumbag? Like that. It surprises your attacker and empowers you. Uh, I see. I need to ask you a favor, Vivi. We want to check out what's ahead. I know you might not be thrilled with the idea, but... Zidane, I want to know more too. Look, what is that thing? Egg machine. Alrighty, we'll all go together. Is this smoke? No. This is... This is mist. Let's open the door.
Surprise! Oh, what the hell are these things? Ghosts? Damn. Ah, stop it. Oh, well, that was easy enough. Stop! Damn, they fucking like ganged up on today, man. Missed monsters, huh? Phoenix down. Potion. Oh, wait. There was something I could inspect there. So many machines. What are they doing here? Looks like it's sending mist to the machines outside. What are those eggs made of? Is that an egg? Is this machine making eggs? This isn't a mist engine, but there's mist coming out of it. A chocobo and gishel grains? The chocobo is powering the conveyor belt. Why don't they just use a machine to do it? Here's another strange machine. Looks kind of like the mist engine on the theater ship. I can almost see inside. But I can't see anything, I just hear some noise. Are those eggs hatching? Ah, what is this? They're... Some parts are different, but... They look like Vivi. What is this? Are they dolls? Someone's coming! Vivi, knife! Why, is my mother behind this? This is the only way. Ah, what are you doing, Zidane? Ah, sorry, but stay quiet. Hey, did you say something? Nope, not me. Okay, never mind. It's almost time. Hurry it up, will ya? I hear ya. Whoa! Zidane? I've been boxed. Ah, Vivi! Pardon me? I must escort a person of high rank to the castle. When will the cargo ship arrive? I'm busy. Hmm, looks good. I'm busy. <laughs> Mr. 
The smell of coffee relaxes me. How about a cup? Oh, thank you. I am not here to drink coffee! Tell me when the cargo ship will arrive, or else the Alexandrian royal family will appropriate this property. And then what? I order you to tell me when the cargo ship will arrive. Tell me! You're not a very creative interrogator. I am just trying to do what is right. Who decides what is right or wrong? You? Anyone can tell from right from wrong. <laughs> Still green as a pickle. When will the cargo ship arrive? It's already here. They should be loading it now. Why couldn't you tell me sooner? Thank you. Ah, it is indeed the cargo ship. Now I can take the princess back to the castle. Now, I must think of a way to get her on the ship. What? There is something coming out of the ground. I wonder what they're going to use them for. We've been making lots of them since they set up the factory six months ago. Who cares? This is a piece of cake compared to farming. Better money, too. Hey, is that scary guy in armor running towards us? Let's get out of here. This barrel, what could be inside? What could they possibly be shipping from this village? What the? Did I just see that barrel move? Let's see. Poke it with a sword. Yeah! Ow! What did you do that for? You! You almost stabbed a knife! The princess? Ouch! Princess, what in the world is going on? You scoundrel, is this your doing? Steiner, please. Yeah, yes, your highness. Zidane, I don't know what to say to Vivi. I never knew anything suspicious was going on at the castle. We still don't know for sure. Let's stay by Vivi's side. This is not the time to panic. I must get the princess on board the cargo ship somehow. Then we can head back to Alexandria Castle. Yo, Rusty, do you know where this airship's going? L Lindblom. Yes, to Lindblom. That's convenient. Did you ask someone? D the old man in the shack told me, so it must be true. You're acting strange. Something is heading this way. Princess Garnett, the queen is waiting for you at the castle. You were, sent you were all sent by the castle? What? What are you talking about? You were all unconscious from the blizzard. He said he was a black waltz. Are you the one who defeated number one? I am black waltz number two. My power, magic, and speed make me far superior to number one. Resistance is futile. Come, princess. The queen awaits. No, I will not return to the castle. Come with me or you'll regret it. Wait! I, Steiner, shall escort the princess back to the castle. <laughs> you think I care? I won't let you stand in the way of my mission. Princess, stay there while I kill the others. Oh, damn, he fucking one shot at Vivi.
Alright, detect. Let's see if you got anything worth stealing. Leather plate. I don't know if other plate's any good, but I'm going to try and steal it. Oh, Jesus Christ! God damn it. Doesn't seem to be too weak to fire. This is how you use fire. Huh. Well, that's a freaking waste. Okay, so if I use just straight up fire, then. He's going to use, like, his own version of it. So I need to avoid it. Why do all the people that look like Vivi look so much cooler than Vivi? It's because Vivi's like a child. He hasn't grown up to he hasn't grown up to put horns on his fucking like hat yet. Jesus Christ. God damn it. Little Witch Jawa. The Little Witch Academia sequel is looking qu is looking wild. Oh, thank God. That was rough.
Black Waltz number two. Did my mother really send him to capture me? It can't be. There is no reason to trust the words of some bandit. He was just another criminal scheming to use the princess for some evil deed. Have I not been careful enough? Your noble upbringing cannot be disguised so easily. That's not true at all. You haven't been watching. Knife is trying really hard. You're the one with the problem walking around yelling princess everywhere. About the border crossing. Yes. Why don't we hitch a ride on this airship? Sure, Lindelum should not be terribly far by airship. I mean, won't be too far. But should, would, should we go get some rest before we go? Rest at the end, yes. Okay, let's head back to the village. Vivi, you'll be safe with me. Yes, I desperately need to, to heal. Still going. Also need to pick up some Phoenix Downs because holy shit, I used a bunch of them. Oh, do you not sell Phoenix Downs? I'm sorry we're not open yet. Do you need medicine? Yes. Oh, thank God. He's out cold. Oh, I'm sorry. He? Hmm? I thought they'd captured it already. Hey, I know she's cute, but it's rude of you to stare. Oh, no, I wasn't staring at the young lady. The room is through the door. Stay calm. save so I don't have to do that fight again. Oh, I did steal some stuff. Let's see what I got. I really want Detect, but I also need Bandit. Steeple Hat has Protect. Chakra? Ice damage reduced by 50%. I don't think any of them can you learn that anyways. The rest. Uh, I want protect girls to stay on, so I'm gonna go. <gasps> Oops, excuse me. I'm gonna go outside and fight like one thing, so I can get the AP for it.
freaking snake. This is a thick ass snake. Is that two AP? One? God damn it. Uh, I need one more. Come on. Ah, damn it. Well, that's cool. I didn't know the Mage Master silenced enemies. That's good to know. bit there. Which means I can put on another plate without worrying. I don't have any accessories yet. Just making sure that I have everything. I don't want to take off broadsword yet. Beast killer is an, is an important skill to have later on. In fact, all the killers are very important to have. Go sleep one more time. Oh, wait, no, I want to save. Let's save, Koopa. I sometimes wonder like what the instrument is that they use to like record the the Moogle sounds because it's just so weird. I'm just imagining a whistle that someone made that makes Koopo noises. Wait here while I ask the people inside if we can hitch a ride. Uh, I shall go ask them. Oh, really? How come? It, it is not for your benefit. I am only doing this for the princess. Steiner? He was so adamant about going back to the castle before. An airship full of barrels like the ones I saw at the castle. Steiner was against going. 
So, Dane, is this airship really headed for Lindblom? No, it'll probably take us straight to Alexandria Castle. But why? Didn't you just say we should get on the airship? Yeah, I know. Trust me. Zidane? <coughs> oh, excuse me. What is it, Vivi? Those dolls they were making underground. Did you think they look like me? Not really. They're just dolls, maybe. It's moving. What the heck is Steiner up to? Alright, we have to get on knife. On a ship that's not going to Lindblom? I don't have time to explain. This way. You better hurry. Hurry up. You have nothing to worry about. Hurry before she takes off. But... I'll take you to Lindblom, I promise. Fine, I'll get on. It's taking off. Ooh, soft. Bruh, just copped a feel. Come on, it's not like I did it on purpose. Please, enough. There's that royal tone in your voice again. Are you okay, Vivi? Feels like I'm gonna get sucked into the sky. Let's go inside, Vivi. I trust you, Zidane. I get the feeling she doesn't quite trust me yet. Maybe she'll reward me with a kiss or two if I try hard enough. Wow, already? Zidane! What is it? Something wrong? It's Vivi. Vivi? Uh, um... Wow, they're alive and they're moving around. So the mages built in the village bring back the new ones? Oh, Vivi. Vivi! Uh, um... Vivi! Were you able to talk to any of them? No. It's like... They don't even see me at all. I tried... Again and again, but they won't even turn around. Phoebe. I need to go upstairs for a little bit. I gotta turn the ship around before it reaches the castle. Keep an eye on Phoebe, okay? Who is behind all this? Is that a treasure chest? It looks like a treasure chest, but it's actually a part of the ship. Urgh, rude. How could this happen? What am I to do? I never expected things to go so badly. I cannot believe this ship took out took off with the without the princess. What will I say to Queen Braun? What the heck were you doing? You almost took off without us. That is because the ship's crew. Why you? Where is the princess? In the engine room. She is on the ship. All is well now. This ship will return will be is returning to the castle. You will be hanged for the kidnapping of a member of the royal family. Enjoy your freedom while you can. 
I will not let you near the princess. At last, Queen Braun is sure to be is sure to be pleased. However, the princess would would have been left behind without the thief's aid. I shall petition for a life sentence on his behalf. Yes, that would be the honorable thing. But that was because the crew wouldn't listen. I must run a background check on them. Ah, yes, it is my duty as a knight. What the? Yoink. <laughs> Just they're watching like, bruh. You, 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 you. What's wrong? Something got stuck in your throat? You insolent fool! Turn the ship around! Gah! I will have your head for that! Hey, I think we upset them. But they didn't respond to anything until now. You're the one who started this trouble. I apologize. Please wait while I take this fool into custody and turn this ship around. What's wrong? No! Vivi! Are you okay? So number two was defeated by a small child. You are no match against my power. Qua! <laughs> Princess, stay there while I eliminate this child. Are you protecting him? Nonsense. You are no different from mindless dolls. What can you do? Get out of my way. Do you dare fight a black waltz? I said get out of my way. Oh no. Rip not VVs. What cruelty! Ah! Master Vivi, I shall assist you! Hey, you guys! Ugh. Knife! Yes. We'll take care of the Black Waltz. You, steal, you steer the ship. Things are going to get even more dangerous from here on. It's not too, too late to turn back. You can go back to the castle or cross Southgate into Lindblom. It's your choice. I'll be with you either way. But try not to crash the ship. Be careful, Zidane. I'll be fine. Why? Why would you do such a thing? Weren't they your friends? You fool. Do I look like some lowly black mage soldier? Even if they weren't your allies, what you did was reprehensible. <laughs> Worry not about them. Many more are being produced right now. What are you? Ah, uh, the princess's bodyguards have gathered. How very convenient. Answer me! It wouldn't do you any good if I answered since you were all going to die. <laughs> I will eliminate any who stand in my way. Alright, this fight is a little bit harder because I don't have Garnet with us.
Silver gloves, linen surus, steepled hat. I need the, I need the armor and the gloves. I don't want the hat. Trying to lower his health so that I can kill him easily once I get everything I need. Put VV on healer bot mode. Focus on stealing now. Now I just need the gloves. There we go. Awesome. Now I can focus on just taking him out. But BB on the healer on the healer bot roll. Please stop. God damn it.
God damn it. Why? Stop bullying Vivi! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, come on. At this point, we better just try and kill it. Oh, Christ. Well, that sucked. Maybe I have some gear I can equip that'll help. Oh, never mind. I guess it'll just start me right from here. Yada, yada, yada. Now I gotta steal everything again. Got the Quirus, or Cirrus, or however you pronounce that thing. This fight is hard. This fight is hard not only because you don't have Garnet with you, but you also are missing, like, a fourth body that can just do actions. The action economy is so just rough in this fight because you're missing a person. Thank God I have that uh, thing. All right, got everything we need.
Oh shit, we won. Thank God. You, you scum. I exist only to kill. What a, t what a sad life. Just how many black waltzes do we have to fight? This is becoming ridiculous. I think that was the last one. How do you know? Are you? He said waltz, right? Don't you think number three would be the last one? I can see the south gate. She's going for it. Did you see that? That I did see. Our black mage enhancements are enhanced black mages. All defeated. Betrayed us, Steiner did. It is all his fault. Huh? Unstable the ship becomes. Don't let go of the steering wheel. Number three is coming back. True, is it? Hooray! But something is wrong. It's broken. Made his magic too powerful, we did. There's nothing we can do now. We shall depart, depart shall we. Run away! <laughs> they just jump out of the fucking ship. I exist only to kill. 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 Do you see Southgate? Yes. Southgate is a huge gate built exclusively for airships, but... Maneuvering through it could be tricky. Do you want me to do it, Knife? I want to do it on my own. All right. We don't have clearance. They might just close the gate on us. Should be okay, though. Security was totally lax when it came through here on the theater ship. It'll be fine, Captain Knife. Roger! It's old, but the engine's got power. We must turn back! Princess! Princess! Turn the ship around! The Black Waltz is headed straight towards us on an airship! He might crash into us! Knife! Rusty's right! It's headed straight for us! Punch it! Go through the gate! Don't be ridiculous! What if the south gate closes on us? There's no way we can outmaneuver him in this cargo ship! We'll slide him before the gate closes and shut him out! It's our only chance! <coughs> Rusty, turn the power up to max. Knife, stay on course no matter what. Okay. I know we can make it. <laughs> no, Vivi, get back in here. Fire! Well, that gate's closing fast. Good job, dumbass. Oh, South Gate is broken. <laughs> that ship is heading towards the game. He's just going to be sorely disappointed when he reaches it. And we've reached my favorite city in the game, Lindblom. 
I think we pushed it a little too hard. Why so silent, people? We made it. Come on, cheer up. South Gate was badly damaged. It was my fault, wasn't it? Don't worry about it. They'll fix it up in no time. You idiot! The cargo ship was wrecked. We lost all the cargo. And South Gate was destroyed. I can't believe I played a part in this debacle. Steiner. Yes, princess. I didn't mean to get you involved, but you saved us. I thank you. Such kind words. I am not worthy. Well, now I made up my mind. I vow to protect you, princess, until we return to the castle. How do you feel about that knife? He'll follow you to the end of the world. It's okay, Zidane. Hey, I can see the main gate of Blindblum. That's Lindblom Castle? How gigantic! The city of Lindblom is inside the castle. I guess Knife and I will go our separate ways once we reach Lindblom. I see. Just when we were beginning to get close. Sedane? Those black mages and I... Are we the same? I don't understand, Master Vivi. Just what seems to be the problem? I don't know. Master Vivi, why would those mages be the same as you? And why would it matter if they were? Rusty's right. You're an individual, no matter what happens, Vivi. R right. Let's go out let's go out to the deck, Vivi. You've got to see Lindblom from above. It's the best. Look, the Falcon's Gate is right in front of us. Vivi having an existential crisis. God, this city is so fucking cool. Wow, this castle is huge. It's even bigger than Alexandria Castle. Yeah, they don't call it Lindblom Grand Castle for nothing. An indoor airship dock. This is truly amazing. Even Her Majesty's Red Rose would easily fit in here. Knife, you don't look too impressed. Have you been here before? Yes, I came here a few times when I was little. I haven't been here since my father passed away. Here comes the welcoming committee. That's a really old airship. Greetings. I am Princess Garnett Till Alexandros. I humbly request an audience with Regent Sid. You must be kidding. No member of the royal family, let alone a princess, would even ride such a shabby airship. And look at the company you're keeping. How dare you accuse the princess of lying? The princess was forced to come here under extreme circumstances. Then show me some kind of proof of your royal heritage. Very well. This pendant. Is it a falcon claw? No, the shape is a little different. Call Minister Artania. If you weren't such a filthy looking oaf, this wouldn't have been so suspicious of us. Hey, I'm not the idiot with the loud voice and the dirty rusty armor. What? What does what is going on? Sir, we have unknown visitors who wish to see the regent. And one of them is carrying a pendant that looks like a falcon claw. You are dismissed. I'll take care of this. Yes, sir. Uncle Artania. It's good to see you, princess. Please follow me. The regent is waiting.
Lindblom Castle has three levels, all connected by this lift. From the base level, which lies below the mist, you can take a trolley to the harbor and back to the gate. Ships hardly arrive at the harbor anymore since, since travel by air has become so popular. The mist poses great danger, so we've sealed off everything. Just above the base level is the mid-level. You can ride the air cab from the mid-level to, to, to go to town. The upper level contains the royal chamber and conference room. Access to that level is restricted because of the regent himself resides there. Hey Knife, what's Regent Sid like? I lived in Limbum for a while, but I've never met him. Regent Sid is very wise. He always thinks ahead. He may seem a bit odd at times, but he is very dependable. He and my father were best friends. I wonder if he will even listen to what I have to say. Don't worry, we're not leaving until he does. We will arrive at the upper level shortly. Sire, Princess Garnett of Alexandria wishes to see you. Princess, is something wrong? The Regent isn't here, and I don't know who. Take a look at the throne. What in the world? Guac guac. Guac guac. Greetings! Og. Oglop! Sire! What? What? Knife, what's wrong? Why aren't you talking to... Jeez, that's an Oglop! Wow, even the Oglops are big in Lindblom. What is the meaning of this? How dare you greet the princess like this? Get that repulsive bug off the throne immediately and call the regent. Please settle down. You are before the regent. What? Enough of your nonsense. Steiner, stand down. I remember that mustache. Is it really you, Uncle Sid? Yes, greetings all. Walk. I am Sid Fabul, regent of Lenblum. I knew it was you. I recognize your pendant's description. It's so much like my falcon claw. I'm delighted to see you again, Garnet. You have truly become a fine lady. I, on the other hand... Allow me to explain. About six months ago, someone snuck into the castle and attacked the regent in his sleep. Unfortunately, we were too late. The regent had been transformed into an oglip and his wife, Lady Hilda, was abducted. My goodness. Whoever pulled this off had to be highly skilled like me. Humph, I'll bet it was you. That's not possible. How can you be so sure? Do you know who we are? Of course. I may be a bug walk, but I'm still the Lin the ruler of Lindblom. Uncle Sid, I appreciate you seeing me on such short notice. I desperately need to speak to you about my mother. That's what I figured. But I'm sure it can wait till tomorrow. Why don't you all get some rest for today? Thank you. It is time for lunch. Please follow me. Oh, I can't stand the food at the castle. It's way too high class for my taste. How can anyone get full on that stuff? The cheap food here is a lot better. Today's special is... Soup du Silence. Not bad. Yo, Pops, I'll have the stupid special. Who said that? Zidane, I figured it was you. How have you been? All right, I guess. Have a seat. Your soup will be ready in a minute. Do you mind? You're standing in everyone's way. Wow. Hey. Yeah? Do you want a drink? How about you and me go for a cruise on an airship? Really? An airship? Sounds like you've never been on one. You know, Lindblom is quite the sight from high above. Hey, Monkey Tail, you're disturbing the other customers. What the? You've got a tail too, Rat Face. Rat Face? After I finish my drink, I'm going to kick your butt. Hey, Zidane, take it outside. Long time, Zidane. Wh hey, what's up? 
Wait a minute. You forgot my name? I, no, I remember. You're Helga, right? Wrong. Christine? Nope. Oh, yeah. You used to live next door to me. How's it going, Ratchel? Oh, man, you've really gotten big. You nasty little... Come on, I'm just kidding. You know I never forget a pretty girl's name. So how have you been, Freya? Same old Zidane. How long has it been? About three years. Hey, did you ever find anything out about your boyfriend? No. So what brings you to Lindblom? The Festival of the Hunts, what else? It's a good opportunity to test my skills. Oh. Well, I'm sure you'll find him someday. Aren't you participating? Nah, I think I'll pass. Lazy bum. Are you ever going to go back? I have no reason to, for returning to Burmesia. There is nothing there for me anymore. So how's the queen? Is she still as vibrant as ever? Yes, but... Since father died, mother has been acting very strangely. I'm not surprised, Gwakwak. They loved each other so much. We haven't spoken much lately. Also, a suspicious man has been prowling around the castle. I don't know what's going on anymore. I fear that she might be planning something terrible. I brought this matter to everyone's attention, but no one has taken me seriously. They all think I'm distraught over losing my father. I understand why you are so eager. I'm happy you came to me for help. At this point, I think you're the only person Mother will listen to. When I heard that Lindblom's theater ship was coming to Alexandria, I decided to sneak on board and come here no matter what. I just never expected the crew to kidnap me. It was me. I was the one who ordered Tantalus to kidnap you. I once promised your father, Guac, that should anything happen to you, I would protect you. We've known about the disturbances in Alexandria for some time. But had we acted directly, it would have started a war. So I asked Baku for help. He and I go way back. The play was the perfect cover to enter Alexandria and get you out. No one would suspect Lindblom was behind it. We were Guac first to take action because we knew Alexandria would never seek our help. I'm relieved we were able to get you here. At the village of Dali, I saw numerous black mages. They looked like golems controlled by some powerful magic. <laughs> On top of that, they were being created under Alexandria's supervision. I don't know how, how they're related to Vivi, but if Mother is planning to use them for war... We won't let that happen. Even if she were to command an army of black mages, she won't make a move as long as we have our airship fleet. Don't worry, Quack Quack. Everything will be fine. I'm so sorry, Uncle. Now, now, come on. Don't be so formal. I'm helping you because I am un your Uncle Sid, not because I am the Regent of Lindblom. Thank you so much. What is this place? The heart and soul of Lindblom, our airship dock. This is dock number one, where we con conduct our research, Quark. But where are the airships? Lonely, isn't it? We had a new airship model in here about six months ago. It was our latest creation. It didn't require Mr. to fly. The man who attacked you, the man who attacked you, well, he's the was he the one who ran off with it? Good guess, but no. Actually, I met a lovely lady at the pub. Um, when Hilda found out about my little affair, she used her magic and turned me into an ogloop. Then she stormed off in the new airship, which I named Hildegard. Pretty ironic, eh? She hasn't been back since, Squawk. I've been working hard on Hildegard too, but it hasn't been going too well. My mind just isn't the same as an ogloop. I'm hopeless. But that doesn't mean I can't help you. I'll do my best for Alexandria. Thank you. But with Southgate badly damaged, I don't know how we can get to Alexandria. 
Don't worry, Southgate is being repaired as we speak. Once the repairs are finished, we'll go to Alexandria. Yes, I'm sure Mother will finally open her eyes to the truth. Uncle, is something wrong? Huh? No, I was just thinking about the, air, air, the theater ship that crashed. Baku sure has good men working under him. Good morning. You're up early. Lindblom is really is really a busy place. I've never seen this many people before. I wonder where people go if they want to be alone. Lindblom has always been like this. People have come here from all over the world. Some of them come here to become in airship engineers, sculptors, actors. Wow. I don't even remember why I came here my, my first time. Before I knew it, I was living here with my Tantalus brothers. Do they still live here? Yeah, our hideout is in the theater district. I'm going to go there right now. Do you want to come along? Um, that's okay. I'm going to go look around town. Okay, then I'll give you a little tour. No, that's okay. I can go by myself. Oh, okay. Go find yourself a cute girl, all right? Oh, God, Mogster wants to talk again. Hey, bro, what are you going to teach me today? Lots of neat stuff. Today I'm going to talk about the synthesis shop. Gosh, bro, you sure know a lot. Yeah, I know. Ignored. All right. Go explore around the area a little bit. Talk to Mudon. There's a letter for Zidane. Ain't y'all coming back to Alexandria? I'm so lonely. Just kidding, I'm opening a little theater in an alley here. The bartender pal of mine is quitting the saloon and getting into the showbiz. He asked me to help. Your friend is starting a mini theater? Sounds like fun, Koopo. I hope I didn't miss a Moogle. All right, let's go explore the city a little bit. Bobo bird statue. Bobo birds are signs of good fortune according to Olgan myth. The founder of this inn bought the statue and has been passed down for generations. The fuck is that thing? Dun, 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 dun. What a huge town! I'm completely lost! Pardon me. Jeez, you're dressed awfully funny. I am Captain Adelbert Steiner of Alexandria, and I humbly request your assistance to get back to the castle. <laughs> That's a new one. Nice try, but I don't date bums. You should really scrape that rust off. It's disgusting. What? Huh? Do you always strike out that badly? I think you need a new line. A little shine wouldn't hurt either. What are these things? They're called Gishel Pickles. They're one of Lindblom's delicacies. Do you want to try one? It smells terrible! The worse they smell, the better they taste. I guess I'll try one. <laughs> oh my, even the locals don't eat them in one bite. Whew. But you're right, they are good. Wow, this nut smells really good. Oh god. I think I'll buy one. This place has a lot of unusual things. Is this food? It looks good. 
Looks like sesame buns my, the grand, my, that grandpa used to make. Alice's Item Shop. Festival of the Hunt Sale ends today. Wow, there's going to be a festival? Hi, I want to buy this. Oh, are you friends with the Moogles? Huh? That item is called a Koopa Nut. Koopa Nuts are Moogle's favorite food. Oh, I didn't know that. I think that's the last one. Go ahead, honey. It's on me. Really? Thank you. Got, got a Koopa Nut. Um, what is this Festival of the Hunt like? Well, we let a bunch of animals loose and... Oh, there's going to be a lot of animals. It sounds like fun. Thank you. What's so fun about fighting savage beasts? Wait a minute. Did I say animals again? Oh, let's not go in here on the train yet. Let's explore a little bit. Oh, can I not go in there? Okay, fine. I didn't want to go in there anyway. Darn, they're not selling at all. Gishel pickles are good, but they smell really bad. My dogs are barking. If you want to come out on top in the festival, you should really buy some weapons here. Oh, I never checked the stuff that I stole. I don't think I can equip any of it anyways. Um, I don't want to spend money on that. But what I do need to spend money on is synthesis. The fire's too strong! How many times do I have to tell you? A few degrees can make the difference between a good weapon and a bad one. Use a lower flame. Stop nagging. We've got a customer. What is he going to get it through his head? How's it going? Do you want me to make something for the festival? Um, I want both of these, the butterfly sword and the ogre, so I need I need three mage mashers. <laughs> Thought the dude's ass was out in his shorts. Just like just casually wearing some assless chaps. It's all good. I have no idea what what's that does. Equip the butterfly sword for now. Go back to the mage masher when I need to like grind some AP stuff up. What is what does this do? Allows back attack. Interesting. 
Yeah, I don't know what the doggos are barking about right now. They probably see somebody outside. Actually, I should probably equip that instead. Let's go to the theater district now. I absolutely love this city. It's probably one of my favorite, like, in any Final Fantasy set, in any Final Fantasy setting. I just love its, like, almost like steampunk, like, aesthetic. Let's go to the theater district. In fact, I think I based I think I based uh, of more than a few D and D cities that I made in, like on Lindblom itself, or at least small aspects of it. Steam engine. I'm lost again. Where's the princess? The town is big. The castle is big. Why does everything have to be so big? Pardon me, can you tell me where I am? What, are you lost? Gee, you're a soldier for crying out loud. This is the bridge that connects the castle to the airship docks. That big building in front of us houses the docks. Well, what is that large airship? Amazing, isn't it? It's the Hildegard II. Since it's equipped with a steam engine developed by the region itself, it can fly without mist. Impossible! How can it fly without being powered by mist? What cave did you crawl out of? This is the age of steam power. The source of steam power is water. It's much safer than mist. <laughs> Bright future awaits us all. She's late. What's Marissa doing? Oh, hell. Are you Marissa? You're going to go see Lowell, too? Sure. You know, I'm not surprised. Even if I were a guy, I'd still be in his fan club. He's so great. Oh, Lowell, I can't believe his tour ends today. Stop pushing. Hey, who are you? Who am I? I'm Sir Zidane of, of Tantalus, the greatest bandit in the world. Have you ever heard of him? No. Go away. Stop bothering us. Ouch. Hurry up. Where's Lowell? How much longer do we have to wait? Oh no, fangirls, you can't stop them. Please, he'll be here in a minute. Lowell, kiss me. Hello, everyone. What's so special about him? Thanks. I love you guys. See you all again. Damn, that's a big moogle. Damn, I can't see anything. Thanks for coming to see Moogle Wannabe 2, Koopo. We don't care about you and your stupid show. We came to see Lowell. Ew. Hey, you're... No, I'm not! Yo! Poor guy. It's tough being popular. I should know. We were supposed to meet here. Where is she? Big Moogle just walked by heading towards the station. He looked kind of dizzy.
I figured there wouldn't be anybody here. Looks like no one's been here for a while. What to do, what to do. Jeez, it's that late already? I wonder what Knife's doing. <laughs> A bell's ringing. A performance in the theater district must have ended. Is there anything you need, your highness? No, thank you. I'm thinking of going outside and having a look around. I'm sorry, Your Highness, but we cannot grant this request. Right now, there are p many people coming to Lindblom for the Festival of the Hunt. Therefore, things are quite chaotic in the town, making security rather difficult. Also, very few people know your presence here. It's for your own safety. Please understand. Okay, I understand. I can't stand sitting around like this. I didn't come here to be protected. I just want to help Mother. There he is! What kind of name is Bunce? I told you he'd be here. Why didn't you tell us that you were back? We're in Tintalus too, you know. What? Yeah! Uncle Baku said if we found some treasure, we can be in Tantalus too. Yeah, check this out! Wow, those are Trick Sparrow's wings. You should, that sure is some treasure you found, all right. Yay! Yippee! So did the plan work? Yeah, Princess Garnett is at the castle. Really? Wow! So what's she like? Is she cute? Did you ask her out yet? No, I think she's pretty busy. Plus, she's a princess and I'm a... You know, so... I don't know. I bet she misses you. Yeah, you should go see her. Good luck. See ya. I wonder if she got to talk to Sid. Maybe I should go see her. Now time to take the treasure from the hideout. Baku and his crew. Achoo! Well, that tasted good. I can't believe we found a way out of Evil Forest before it got petrified. Yeah, it's all thanks to our bro, who pointed out the river before he took the map to Zidane. What do we do now, boss? We gotta save our brother. You're right. But first, we got, we'll let the guys outside drink some water from the lake. Senna, bring them over. Hey, about blank. I think it's better that Evil Forest stays petrified. Are you serious? Don't get me wrong. I ain't saying this out of concern for our safety. Then why? I'm sure he wouldn't want to be saved if it meant Evil Forest was going to be restored, too. You're right. We gotta start looking. There's gotta be another way to cure this petrification somehow. We ain't too late. We gotta do what we can. I got you, boss. Hey, Cinna, what are you doing over there? The spring water might make some good coffee. I'll get the fixins. Do I gotta remind you what happens to members who don't listen to their boss? No, no, please, not that. I'll bring everyone over right now. No coffee. Oh, hey, there's, here's the guy. You were at the theater. Oh, please, don't tell, don't tell anyone else about this. 
Please, I'll give you this. I got an autograph. Thanks as always, Michael. Jeez, I can't finish my painting with you bothering me every day. Come on, forget about the painting. Let's work together. You can express your artistic talents on stage, too. Don't ever compare your acting with my art. If you're done with your business, get out of here. I wouldn't get involved with him if I were you. Fine, what a waste of talent. Go to the castle. <laughs> Ass cheeks, Michael. <laughs> what are you doing here? You, what have you done with the princess? Where is she? Oh, take it easy. I just got here. The princess is gone. She was supposed to stay in this room. Maybe she went out for a little walk. How could you be so calm? This is a very serious matter. Have you forgotten all the dangers she faced just to get here? What if something terrible happens to her? What am I going to do? I must go find her. Out of my way. Okay, then. Glass armlet. Can I corrupt that? Yes. Oh, Maki, I have a letter for you. It's a letter from Kumop, Koopo Koopo. Thank you very much, Koopo Koopo. Stiltskin vi visited me, Koopo. He said he found a place that seemed interesting and then he left. I wish he stayed longer, Koopo. Where did he go anyway? Let me know when you find out, Koopo. Stiltskin, Stiltskin, Koopo Koopo. I wonder if he stopped in Lindblom. I wonder where she went. That song. I've heard it somewhere before. That sweet voice. It's Knife. She's upstairs. Sorry, only authorized personnel can use the lift. Man, I've got to get past this guy somehow. Maybe if I disguise myself as a guard, he'll let me through. Hey, wake up! Huh? I just saw a suspicious character wandering around. What? Where? Upstairs, follow me. Hmm. 
No, in here, huh? All right, you bastard, show yourself. Hey, what are you doing? That was easy. He even came with the big nose. I should be able to get on the lift now. This is just casually takes it off. Just avoid that. What? A girl? Oh yeah, I saw her go upstairs a just a while ago. Don't worry, I won't report anyone that, that a suspicious individual is here. Nice song. How did you get up here? This is a restricted area. Come on, I do this for a living. Oh yeah, you're a member of Tantalus. It must have been easy for you. Whew, what a view. Hey, there's a telescope. Let's go check it out. Come on. Hmm. Move the telescope. There's probably a lot of weird things living there. Maybe I should check it out sometime. There's some mountains that surround Bermissia. I guess the best way to get there is through the cavern at the base. River that flows right by South Gate. Get there get there to the gate by walking along the river. Hey, there's a chocobo. Maybe I can catch a chocobo in that forest. Alexandria is beyond those mountains. I bet they're looking for us. Oh, there's South Gate. I wonder if they started repairing it. It'll probably take a while to fix everything. Let me see. How's the view? I made so much trouble for everyone. Uncle Sid knew everything. That's why he asked Tantalus to get me out of Alexandria. No matter how hard I try, I'm always a step behind in everything. I'm so helpless. What's wrong? Zidane, why did you help me come here to Lindblom? Is it because your boss ordered you to? I just wanted to help you, that's all. The boss didn't even agree with me. So I ended up leaving the band. Really? I'm sorry. Eh, don't worry about it. This isn't the first time I've left. Zidane. Yeah? Oh, um, how are you planning to abduct me? We were going to put you to sleep with sleeping weed, then kidnap you. It's mostly used for kids, but a big dose can knock out an adult just as easily. I guess you didn't need it since I came along on my own. Hey, would you mind giving me some? I've had a hard time sleeping lately. Um, I don't think that's a good idea. You might get addicted. Maybe all you need is some company, eh? 
Oh, please don't think don't. Do you think I'm that naive? <laughs> Can't blame me for trying. Uh, um, that song, were you singing it in the village of Dolly? Yes. So you were up that night. What is that song anyway? I don't know. I can't even remember where I learned it. I sing it whenever I feel sad or lonely. For some reason, it comforts me and reminds me that I'm not alone. I guess that's a mystical song. Let me hear it again. Hmm. Never expected to find such fine armor in a place like this. Yes, I'll buy that one too. Who knows when that brawn will start another war? What? The queen would never start a war? You dare speak ill of the queen? Who the hell are you? I'm a... an armor collector. Oh, well in that case, can you recommend me some good armor? I... I must go. Go, Knights of Pluto! Yeah! What are those things? They look so stupid. I'm gonna take Sid's airships and destroy them. Hey, cut it out! You broke my knife! I'm gonna go tell your mom. No, come on! Royal action figures? Those black mages were like toys being controlled by someone. The sky looks ominous. Something's about to happen. Sir Fratley, where are you? I need you. Okay. It should work now. Sire, it's no good. What? We can't stabilize the engine system. It can't run for more than 10 minutes. Darn it. My mind hasn't been the same since I became an oglop. Hey, knife. So when do you want to go on that airship cruise? What are you talking about? What am I thinking? I asked the girl at the... Uh, never mind. Well, it sounds like you've asked the wrong girl. Wait, I can, I can explain. Why bother? Go have a wonderful time. Oh, man. Okay, how about this? If I get first place in tomorrow's hunting festival, you and me will go out on a date. How does that have anything to do with me? Come on, please. Fine. Okay, it's a date. It may be tradition it may be tradition, but this is a dreadful festival. So many lives lost every year, especially because of him. Hardly. The festival is a test of manhood. I tingle with excitement every year. This is the last carriage. All the pre all the preparations for the festival of the hunt are complete. Very good. Now we wait for the signal. Yes, sire. Oh no, he's dead. The fangs have been freed. What? We haven't even received the minister's authorization. We believe that they're going to release him any minute. Alright, release the moose before they let him loose. Hurry! Big cats. All is ready. Alright, stand by. This year's specimen is perfect. Nothing can stop him. Ha ha ha, what power? Hey, make him stop. It's too early to let him loose. How? I have no control over him. Damn it. Open the gate at once. The gate's gonna fall apart. Go, Zagnol! Where's Zidane? Please, princess. You might actually enjoy it. Okay. I wonder if Zidane has improved his skills. Hey, guys. Sorry I'm late. All right. Let's begin. 
Hunters on your mark. Ferocious beasts swarm the castle town. The bigger the catch, the higher the score. The time limit is 12 minutes. Use air cabs to go to the other districts. Once you lose in a battle, you will be forced to retire. The winner will be crowned Master Hunter and receive the Hunter's Reward. Who will come out on top? What do you wish for your Hunter's Reward? I'll go with Gil all the way. I'll take an add-on. And you, Mr. Beebe? What? I never signed up. I thought you would do pretty well, so I signed you up. Don't worry, with your black magic, it'll be a piece of cake. Uh, I don't know. That was very inconsiderate of you, Zidane. Oh. How about this? If you win, I'll fix you up for a date with Knife. Me and the princess? Shh, keep it down. What was that? You just mentioned the princess. What evil deeds are you plotting now? It's nothing, right, Vivi? Yeah. So what would you like as your reward? Oh, um, I'll take a card. Okay, Gil, an add-on, and a card. The festival will begin shortly. You all have different starting points. Hunter Zidane will start in the theater district. Hunter Freya will start in the industrial district. And Hunter Vivi will start in the business district. So the festival is a little interesting in that, surprisingly, the best option is actually to not let Zidane win. Because ideally, ideally you want, uh, because Freya joins in, joins a little bit later, she get, you want her add-on. Uh, is it this way? Because the add-on is particularly good this early in the game. Whereas Gil, while nice, is you can get pretty much anywhere else, and unless you want to do the card game. There's not really much of a point to having VB win. So I'm going to try and let Freya win, but if I accidentally come out on top, I'm not going to worry about it too much. Such rudeness! Princess, they are treating you like a commoner! Oh, hush. We get a great view from here. Hmm, you're right. I can see the entire town. Princess, look! Master Vivi is also participating. I can't believe it. He seemed reluctant earlier. Master Vivi! The princess and I are rooting for you! Come on, Vivi! You can do it! No! Master Vivi! Look out! Oh gosh, I can't watch anymore. You can't win just by running! A good offense is the best defense! Attack! You can't lose to that monkey, Zidane! Yes, that's it! Now's your chance! One more time! Baby behind you! Yes, go! Great Scott! I love this little cat monster, it's so cute. Oh, of course you make me trance. Thanks for wasting it, bucko. Zidane leads with 11 points. Trick Sparrow. Ten points. VV leaves with thirty points. Shh. 
So my my strategy is is to just kind of participate until the timer comes down to about I think it's three minutes. It's three minutes or five. I can't remember exactly which. It's pretty close to the end of the timer, but the Zagnol comes out in a certain district. And then Freya joins on the fight. And I can have Freya win by defeating the Zagnol. Damn, 644 damage. Oh, I need to buy some potions when I get a chance. Uh, go to the industrial district for now. Vroom. I don't think I've been to the industrial district. I, don't, I think we skipped it. Freya leads with 58 points. I turned on a auto fight on for somehow and I'm not sure how I know how to turn it off. I've got better things to do than hang out at the pub. Oh! Ah, see? I was right, Zidane. Ow. Go to the business district.
right, he's over here, and I don't know if he's spawned yet. Nope. Just sit around and wait until the five minute mark. Well, I guess not yet. Let's go over here real quick. These people did a terrible job with their safety. Just let these these people run, roam around with all these monsters about. Thank you. save Vivi from this thing. Yep, here he is. Zidane, help! Hey, big boy, turn around. Damn, you're ugly. Allow me to help. Okay, but I get to finish him. I've got a date with a knife on the line. You're ridiculous. Fine, as you wish. There we go. No need to worry about him now. Now I don't have to worry about Zidane accidentally finishing it off. thing's got a mustache. Though I'm in a slightly dangerous position. I hope this finishes it. There we go. So Dan has retired. That was marvelous, all of you. 
214 points. Congratulations. We grant you the Master Hunter and your reward. Receive Coral Ring and Master Hunter. My hat's off to you, Freya. I don't know how you racked up so many points. The fruits of my training, I suppose. Regent. Please forgive my intrusion. I bring urgent news from our king. The king of Bermetia? Sorry, you must not let him see you like this. Take a good look at him. An, an injury has blinded him. Continue. Our kingdom is being attacked by some unknown force. We are severely outmatched. Please send reinforcements immediately. The enemy looks like an army of mages wearing steeple-crowned hats. The kingdom and I are the king and I are old friends. We will send reinforcements to Bermesia immediately. Thank you, Regent. The king and all of Bermesia will be most grateful. I must return now. Ugh. Take him to the infirmary. It's too late. He's gone. It's a miracle he even made it this far. I can't believe this is happening. This is a problem. Because of the festival, there are hardly any men left in the castle. It will take time to mobilize. <coughs> oh, excuse me. We have no choice. Call back the 4th Aerial Division patrolling the border. But if we recall the fourth, we, we if we recall the fourth, we will lose our eyes over Alexandria. Quark quark. Bermetia is our ally. We must help them. Steeple crowned hats. They might be black mages like Vivi. It can't be. Could it be mother? I must go now. I cannot sit and wait for reinforcements. I'm coming with you. No, this doesn't concern you. What's this? I'm a stranger all of a sudden? I'm not going to sit back and watch your home get destroyed, all right? Thank you, Zidane. Um, can I come too? I want to find out who they really are. Sure. All right, then. Let's go to Bermesia. Princess, this is a foreign matter. It has nothing to do with us. Steiner is right. We don't know if Alexandria is involved. But if black mages are involved, Zidane, you know what I'm talking about. If Mother is behind this, I'll make her stop. I promise. I think you should stay here. What? We don't know what to expect here. I've already faced great danger coming here. What's the difference? Knife, this is war. A lot of people are going to die. I know that. How did you feel when you saw that Bermetian soldier die just now? I felt sad, of course. Just sad? Weren't you scared, too? Obviously, you haven't realized how dangerous it's going to be. You could get killed. This is no time to be talking about convincing your mother of anything. But... Now, not, now's not the time to argue. He's right. We must head to Bermetia at once. Will you open the dragon's gate? Of course. If you're going by foot, leaving by the gate is the best way. Let us eat while we walk. Wait for the gate to open. Ah, well, the kingdom is being destroyed. Let us feast. Yay, I'm so hungry. The festival of the hunt feast is one of our oldest traditions. It began well over five centuries ago. It is a customary to eat everything with your hands, so go on before it gets cold. Thank you, uncle. Hmm, it's so good. Let's just eat. We can't do anything until the gate opens. You're right. Hey, not bad. This is wonderful. Princess, how is everything? Why aren't you eating? Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. Everything is so delicious. Indeed it is, especially this beef. It is superb. Ah, yes, the beef. Oh, I'm so full. I'm getting sleepy now. What the? Knife! The food is poisoned! 
How can I be so careless? Oh, I'm starting to feel sick. But give me, princess. I should have tasted it for poison. That's impossible. There shouldn't be any in your dish. What? Now that you mention it, I feel just fine. H how did you know? <gasps> princess, you didn't. It's not poison. It's just a medicinal herb Zidane gave me. Believe me, this was not what I had planned. Steiner, I have to make my own decisions. I had no choice. Uncle, Sim Uncle Sid would not let me leave this castle. That is because he is concerned about you. I understand, but... No, you don't understand. War is a terrible thing. You must never experience it as I have. I'm sorry, princess. I cannot follow any orders that might put li your life in danger. What if Alexandria is behind the attack on Bermesia? It could lead to war between the three great nations. Many innocent people will die. As the princess of Alexandria, there must be something I can do. I have to help mother. I don't want to see anything happen to her. Very well. Princess, I will follow you wherever you choose. Thank you. Let's go before everyone wakes up. I'm sorry, Zidane. Come on. Knife, where are you going? It must have been some sort of sleeping medicine. It was sleeping weed. We've been had! I gave her some because she said she was having problems sleeping. I'm impressed. There's more to her than meets the eye. Damn, what the heck is she thinking? Maybe she's headed to Bermesia. Then you might still be able to catch up with her. Vivi, wake up. We're going to Bermesia. Let's head for Gizmaluk's grotto. Once we pass through the grotto, we will be in Bermesia. You can leave from the Dragon's Gate, located at the base level. <laughs> Take a nap and the next thing you know you're being drafted off and to go into a war. How fucking sad. I got a letter from Stiltskin. Do you know Stiltskin Kubo? I left Limblum and headed north. I walked through the mist and Gizmaluk to reach Bermesia for the first t very first time. It's raining as expected. I'm going to look for shelter now. He went to Bermesia? It might be dangerous there, Koopo. Oh, we're gonna need some fucking potions since I don't have our fucking healer with us. Alright. Before we go to Gizmolik's Grotto... We want to go to the marshland. Q's Marsh. Dun, dun, dun. The fucking timpani. Beep, bop, bop. Hey, it's you two. I already know everything. Gosh, bro, you sure know a lot. Ah!
Oh, I didn't equip anything to Freya. God damn it. Right back to... Wake up, go out, what, go out of town for a little bit and come right back and you're immediately asleep again. Jagoon rat. I love Freya, one of my favorite Jagoons. Got a frog card. Hungry. I hate this character, but I need them. We accuse big frog eaters. Frogs give much energy. You got frog. Frog's very good. Mm. Who the heck are you? Me? Quinna, do you want this frog? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. All right, here. Yay! Quinna received a frog. Quinna will now die for you. Mine, mine. You pathetic Quinna can't even feed yourself. Can't master art of eating, just chasing frogs, Quinna. But master, frogs very good. Frogs here best, better than Alexandria's. Quinna, you in darkness, need some light. World big place, many, many foods. Alexandria is just one kingdom. You need to go out more. Eat other food. Go out into world? Sounds scary. Are there yummier frogs outside? Of course. Many good frogs. All Qs love frogs best. Eating frogs is key to growth. Q marshes exist all over the world. Go eat frogs in other marshes. I promise you get much learning. Traveler, please show Quinn of the world. Anywhere with food good. You want me to take them with us? Why not? Will I find yummier frogs outside? There's plenty of stuff in the world that tastes better than frogs. Really, really? Okay, I'll go with you. Quinnit exists solely to eat. What's up, Vivi? Um, that man looks exactly like my grandpa. Your grandfather? Who, that quail guy? Yeah, maybe he knows my grandpa. I'm gonna go talk to him, Zidane. What wrong? Something on face? Um, do you know a man named Quan? I know not that bigot. Wow, okay, damn. Grandpa Quan was a bit strange, but... How do you know him? I I can no, can no answer. Grandpa Quan looks exactly like you, Mr. Quail. Of course, we're from the same tribe. You really don't know him? No, I know not this Quan. Honestly. That's too bad. Let's go, Vivi. Okay. <laughs> You're an old you're an old man. Surely you know every other old man, right? Okay.
let's see here. Let's put on antibodies and point important. I also need bright eyes and all that. Yeah, they kind of do remind me of Peaches from Animal Crossing. Zidane, can I catch frogs? Sure, let's catch some frogs. You're working hard, Quinna. Let me interrupt your frog catching activities. Come far a long way of Gormand, I give you this. Thank you, Master Quail, I train more. Come on, Gold Frog. You working hard, Quinna. No, I'm not done. <laughs> he looks so defeated. I want to capture all the frogs here before we go. Come on. <laughs> ah! Got it. Woo! Had enough, Quinna? Did the frogs respawn? No, they don't. I have to go to other marshes and catch more. Quinna has some of the weirdest like mechanics in the entire game. Quinna's like main thing is that sh is that they can eat enemies, and if they eat certain enemies, they get mad. They can like learn magic from them. So like, Ah, damn it, we killed it. You have to get them down, like, very low on health, and then you have to eat them. 
for your enemies to get their power. Disgustingly, that is how it works. Quinna is a blue mage. So we're going to see if we can learn any. So I want to learn blue magic before... Before we go fight Gizmaloot Grotto's boss. Quinna is either one of the strongest people you get or one of the weakest, depending on how you treat them. Oh, nice. I ate them. I have no idea what Vanish does. Makes a party member disappear. Ugh. Ah, oh, damn it. getting murdered by ladybugs. How much weaker did you want it to be? I think this is a good place to stop for now. I can go ahead and like do a lot of blue mage grinding like off camera and whatnot. At least in this part. I also need to level up some of my uh, add-ons and whatnot. So I'll go ahead and end the stream here. Thank you all so much for watching. Um, uh, we'll pick up we'll pick up again probably next Tuesday about the same time. We gotta make Quinta stronger. Gotta eat everything. The funny thing is is that you absolutely have to make Quinta one of your stronger people. There's a certain point in the game where you have to send your some of your weaker people out. And you, where you have to use literally everybody you have. And if you haven't leveled up Quinna, then you're in deep shit. 
my first time playing through, I didn't level up Quinn at all because I just couldn't be bothered to, to learn the blue mage magic stuff. And boy, oh boy, did it fucking suck. So, all right. Thanks again for watching, y'all. Uh, you have a good night.